This is a musician tutorial. Um, Donica wants to show you that it's not too hard to play. So I promise her it's something I'd like to be in one of the tutorial videos. So this should be the big one. This might be the last one. All right, go ahead. Donica's done doing a little demo of the sound. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll do a demo of uh, somebody who's really been practicing it, um, what it can sound like, and then I'm going to show you how it works. Okay. Okay, okay you got a couple noises in. There you go. Hi. Here we go. A musician is essentially a guitar being the force Okay. The basic effects are distortion. And you can put an octave harmonic. Sound more natural. Okay. And this slider here is a sort of FM distortion. You can mix and match between the red distortion and the uh, FM distortion. Stereo. Um, the fingers, are each, it's a stereo for fingers. Okay. So. Okay. Um, right, this slider sets the timer for the echo. So it's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Feedback. Okay, and bring it to the surface. And the reverb back in. So, solo mode. One mode at a time. One note for string. So it's kind of like the solo mode on a, on a piano keyboard, except you can do um, chords still. Okay. And of course, full power phone, which is what musician has had since the beginning. Okay. Now, um, explain the, the reverb, but this volume here, um, okay, this, this green volume here exists because when you're playing along with iTunes, if you turn the volume up or down, unfortunately the volume of the app goes up or down with the volume of what you're playing in the background, so I had to do this in order to get the right mix. Um, and of course, presets. Um, this little lock here, when you first come in, 
everything will be gray so that if you run your fingers across stuff, nothing gets changed. Okay. But what's important is when it turns gray, it saves it to disk. So this is basically the same, same flight of controlling two things, which is um, save to disk or um, um, lock presets like maybe change. Okay. So you use the sliders to just kind of move among all the presets and you unlock them if you want to change it and play around with it. Give you a demo of what it should sound like and just playing it right. My first time off. and sloppy compared to some of the stuff I've seen before, so, yeah, you get the idea, it's a sound. Uh -huh. 